The COVID-19 pandemic has significantly impacted the public health of people around the world. One of the most urgent needs during this outbreak is to address the shortage of N95 respirators, a necessary form of personal protective equipment. Here, we demonstrate that the dry heat generated by the simple electric cooker can decontaminate viruses without compromising the filtration efficiency. The cooker provides dry heat by heating the interior surface of the pot. The temperature inside of the pot rapidly increased to 170 degrees Celsius within five minutes and fluctuated over the next hour. The respirator temperature also increased to around 100 degrees Celsius. Please keep in mind that the temperature of the pot surface is higher than the melting point of the respirator, so direct contact between the respirator and the pot surface will damage the respirator. To prevent this, you can use a towel to line the interior surface of the pot. Place a respirator that you want to decontaminate on the towel. Depending on your pot size, several respirators can be stacked and disinfected at the same time. Then, close the lid and start the cooking process. Viruses inoculated inside and outside of the respirator were inactivated by at least 99.99%. Once the cooking process is terminated, you can open the pot and take out the respirators. We confirmed that the filtration efficiency was still acceptable for an N95 respirator after 20 treatment cycles. These respirators are now ready to be used again. We tested three M N95 respirators and our electric cooker was a Farberware model number WM-CS60004W. We did not test other devices or masks. We assume no responsibility for people or entities using this content in any way and we do not recommend deviating from the method and materials described and shown in this video and this paper. For those using a different type of cooker or oven, carefully review the safety instructions of the cooker or oven manual. The respirator's temperature will need to be measured with an infrared thermometer throughout the decontamination process. The respirator needs to be at 100 degrees Celsius for 50 minutes. Ensure that the respirator is not too close to the heating surface of the cooker or oven so that the mask is not melted or damaged. After the decontamination process, remove the respirator from the cooker with clean hands. Search dry heat as a decontamination method for N95 respirator reuse for more information.